What if the civilization you knew was not the first to rise or the last to fall? Indeed, imagine a world where the cycle of civilizations takes an unexpected turn. A world where the reins of power are passed not from one human civilization to another, but to our closest relatives in the animal kingdom, the apes. Picture the dawn of this new civilization, the early stages, much like our own, filled with discovery and growth. The first steps of an ape using tools, the first words spoken, the formation of communities. Now, imagine their initial interactions with us, their human counterparts. A mix of curiosity, confusion, and perhaps even conflict, as two intelligent species try to find their footing on the same planet. Thus began an era where apes ruled, a civilization that was set to face challenges and triumphs like any other. The dawn of a new civilization, unlike anything we've seen before. In this new world order, apes were not just surviving, they were thriving. Undeniably, the rise of the apes was a remarkable phenomenon. From the outset, they showed an uncanny ability to learn and adapt grasping complex concepts swiftly and applying them to their burgeoning civilization. Their communities expanded rapidly, evolving from scattered tribes into organized, intricate societies. Before long, these societies began to rival those of humans, their previous overlords. In a world where communication is key, the apes excelled. They developed a unique language, a blend of sign language, vocalizations, and body language, which allowed them to converse and share ideas in a manner previously thought impossible for their species. This breakthrough in communication was a pivotal point in their evolution, fostering unity and cooperation amongst them, and fueling their rise to power. But it wasn't just communication that set them apart. The apes exhibited an extraordinary aptitude for technology. They used tools in innovative ways, repurposing found objects to serve their needs, and even creating their own when necessary. They weren't merely using tools. They were inventing and refining them, displaying a level of intelligence and resourcefulness that was both astonishing and unsettling. Their societal structures, too, were a testament to their adaptability. From the establishment of leadership hierarchies to the division of labor, the apes mirrored many aspects of human society, but with their own unique twists. They created a system that worked for them, a system that ensured their survival and prosperity. However, it wasn't simply their ability to mimic human society that led to their dominance. It was their capacity for empathy, their sense of community, and their unwavering determination to protect their own that truly set them apart. These qualities, combined with their intelligence and adaptability, led to their meteoric rise, shifting the balance of power on the planet. The apes had established their dominance, but with power comes responsibility and inevitable challenges. As they stood at the pinnacle of their civilization, Little did they know of the trials that awaited them in their quest to maintain their newfound status. But as the apes rose, so did the stakes. As with any civilization reaching for the stars, the apes faced their fair share of growing pains. The newfound power they wielded brought forth its own set of challenges and its own set of conflicts. The apes, once united in their quest for freedom, now found themselves embroiled in internal struggles for control. Ambitions flared, alliances shifted, and the once harmonious society began to fracture. The struggle for power is a tale as old as time, and the apes were no exception. The unity that had propelled their rise was now threatened by the very power they had sought. And then there was the human factor. The apes had coexisted with humans, even learned from them. But as their civilization grew, so did the tension. The humans saw the rise of the apes as a threat, while the apes saw the humans as an obstacle to their progress. It was a classic standoff, a powder keg waiting to explode. But it wasn't just about power and dominance. The apes' rapid expansion put a strain on their environment. The once lush and thriving ecosystem began to buckle under the pressure. The apes were facing a crisis of their own making. They had to learn to balance growth with sustainability, to understand that the health of their planet was intrinsically tied to their survival. 
The consequences of these conflicts were far-reaching. The stability of the civilization was shaken to its core. The apes were learning, sometimes harshly, that the path to progress is fraught with obstacles. That power, unchecked, can lead to downfall. That coexistence requires compromise, that the health of a planet is not a resource to be squandered, but a gift to be cherished. The apes were learning that the fate of a civilization is not just about power, but about how one handles adversity, and as they stood on the precipice of their destiny, they had to make a choice, face the challenges head-on, or risk losing everything they had fought for. All civilizations rise and fall, and the apes were not exempt from this universal truth. The apes, having formed a civilization of their own, experienced the same ebb and flow that societies before them had seen. Their story, much like ours, was not simply one of ascent, but also of decline. The culmination of conflicts and crises led to a series of final battles, each more devastating than the last, tearing at the very fabric of their society. The ape civilization, once a beacon of hope, began to crumble, ravaged by the very conflicts that had spurred their rise. These battles, intense and brutal, were not just a physical clash, but a collision of ideologies, of values, of visions for the future. They were the manifestation of the internal struggles that had been brewing within their society, a reflection of the discord that had grown too large to contain. As the dust settled, the aftermath was stark. The world the apes had built filled with promise and potential lay in ruins. Their cities, once bustling hubs of activity, were now ghost towns. Their society, once vibrant and dynamic, was now a shadow of its former self. The fall of the apes was a poignant reminder of the fragility of civilizations, of the transient nature of power, and of the cyclical pattern of rise and fall that has marked the course of history. But the implications of this fall were not limited to the apes alone. It reshaped the relationship between the apes and the humans, redefining the dynamics of power and survival. It altered the course of the world, setting the stage for new beginnings, for fresh narratives to unfold. In the end, the apes' civilization fell, leaving behind a world forever changed and a story that reminds us of the cyclical nature of civilizations. The tale of the apes serves as a mirror to our own societies, a reflection of our triumphs and our failures, our rise and our fall. It is a story that transcends species and time, reminding us that in the grand scheme of things, we are all players in the same epic saga of civilization.